What's going on everybody? It's your boy Triple C back here with another video. Today I'm uh, going to talk about four pickups that I had. They're all cheapies. One, I, it's a clone of something I have. Um, got all four of these at Marshalls in Burlington. Um, before I start the video, I just want to thank my new subscribers. Thank you and welcome. Um, today's video is my haul and um, some this is my opinion on what I picked up over the weekend. Just going to start off with, um, it's called Red Cherry by Milestone. I picked it up at Marshall's for, it's 17 bucks. Um, it's a clone of Lost Cherry, Smell Lost Cherry. It's the same thing, $16 versus 300 plus for 1.7 for the same size of Tom Ford. Um, lost cherry picked this one up smells good um just real basic it's cherry it's not it's not going to change on your skin um when i tried it out on my skin it lasted uh, about six hours that's pretty good i mean you, you can't really beat it for 17 bucks you're not gonna it's not gonna be as smooth as tom ford's lost cherry i smelled that it's really smooth this one it does the job it's 90 percent there like most clones um the next one I have is Moji, Mo, Moji, maybe, I, maybe I got that right, maybe I don't. Jubilation, it's like a clone of Jubilation 24 by Amouage. That's a $300 scent. Um, I, I have a sample of that. It's, it's in the same wheelhouse. I wouldn't say it's a direct clone, but it's, for what you're paying for it, you can't really complain. Um, paid $16, $17 at Marshall's for this, found it. Um, and it's a clone of Jubilation 24. You're gonna get Oud, Myrrh, Patchouli. Um, when I tested this out, it lasted maybe eight eight hours on my skin. Then it, um, it kind of transitioned into like a honey like a honey scent, which is really nice. Uh, the Jubilation 24 does, and it's, it stays on there. Whatever you spray it on there, it's, it's going to stay with you all day. Um, like I said, it's $16. They even kind of copied the bottle of Jubilation, all the old um, M-Wash bottles. And the next one I have is from a house that's really, I wouldn't even call it clone. It's just a good, cheap fragrance, but it's quality. Um, it's called tuberose overdose. Um, I smelled it. And, um, when I opened the package, I initially gave it to my girlfriend because this is, um, uh, this is really feminine, like really feminine. Um, wasn't my, I couldn't, I usually, sometimes I could pull it off of wearing like, you know, feminine, feminine fragrances, but this one is just, it's for women, but the bottle is gorgeous. I really do like the bottle. Kind of got my attention. Uh, I picked this up at Burlington for twenty bucks. Your standard twenty bucks. Um, another tip I'll give you: uh, when the holiday seasons calm down, um, hit up Burlington during the week. Um, kind of don't go on the weekends because everything's picked over, and you'll find a lot, a lot of the fragrances that you know from especially Banana Republic, the dark amber and cherry, I believe is what it's called. It's a Baccarat Rouge 540 clone. It's really good. Um, if you have a Burlington near you, a TJ Maxx, uh, I haven't really seen these in Ross, but um, I would hit those up. Really don't pay uh, online prices. Some people are trying to sell this for 40, 40 and $50. You can hit up your local TJ Maxx Burlington and get it for twenty dollars all day, um, but this is it smells good, uh, fellas. If you have a girlfriend or your wife, it really smells good. Um, not for not for me personally, but for for the ladies, this is really good. And again, that is tuberose overdose by Banana Republic. And the last one I'm gonna bring to you is a uh, it's, it's another milestone. It's called Ombre Leather. The name is not. Kind of confused me too about Ombre Leather by Tom Ford. I don't know if you can see it up there. It's in that corner right there. Can't see it. Anyway, um, 
it's a clone. I, I thought it was a clone of uh, ombre leather just by the, the name, but it's not. It's actually a clone of ombre nomad by Louis Vuitton. Um, when I wore this one, it, it, it goes in that it's the opening is a little, a little harsh, but you still kind of, if you've ever smelled ombre nomad, um, it's in that same window. Um, but I paid six, once again, $16. I, I get it. Um, this is $16. This is 330 at, at LV. So I, I get it. Um, this is 90% there. You know, 90% there. You really, somebody smell it on you, you're going to smell oud and rose. This, this rose is not as smooth and like, um, blended well, like, of course, the, um, the LV one, but for 17, $16, you can't, you really can't complain. Um, Lasts about on my skin about eight hours. It's oud and and rose. Um, I picked it up at I want to say I think it was Marshalls. Like I said in the beginning, um, if you like rose and oud and you want to try it and not not pay three thirty for 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 this, um, this would be a it'd be a good option. Cheap. If you don't like it, I mean it's sixteen dollars. You can resell it. Um, kind of threw, like I said, it kind of threw me off because the bottle is shaped of a Tom Ford, but it's the scent in there is um, from LV. I like what y'all doing, Milestone. Y'all, 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 real smooth with that one. Um, but anyway, that's a little short video today. That's just my pickups over over the holiday season. Um, once again, I like to thank my new subscribers. Um, I'm gonna get. I'll, I'll have some more videos coming real soon. Um, like, share, and subscribe. And um, if you have any, what are your, some of your clones you found, like in the, your local stores that you would like to share, leave it in the comments, and I'll reply to you. Peace.